much. Hello and welcome to the Bird Tales. Today is November 7th, which is Minnesota's deer opener, and it is a hot, dry day. It is 67 degrees and windy. Yesterday we were in a red flag warning. It's just crazy because two weeks ago it was 15 degrees and we had 18 inches of snow, and now it is almost 70 and bone dry. I've got a WMA behind me, I've got Skip in the kennel, and I got a rooster. We headed down into this WMA with the intention of pretty much walking the whole entire perimeter. Um, back there, I don't know if you can see, but in those trees back there, uh, the collar buzzed and Skip was on point and I turned to look just as the rooster flushed. So I don't know if Skip got too close or if he saw us or what, but he got out of there. Like I said, it's super dry. The scenting conditions are really bad, so it wouldn't surprise me if Skip just got too close, pointed right as he saw the bird and then the bird flushed. But that rooster flew up out of there and landed somewhere down there in the cattails. He was hundreds of yards away from us and I just kind of had a, a mental idea of he's over there somewhere. So we just kept doing what we were planning on doing, walked almost the whole perimeter, didn't see a single other bird. Then uh, on the way back, I figured let's walk through those cattails where he was. At least we know there's one bird in there. And uh, Skip went on point once. I got over to him and then we just kind of did this slow. He was walking in front of me. He'd stop for a second. He'd keep going, stop for a second, keep going. And then the rooster flushed up in front of us maybe 10 yards away. And I got a good shot off. So. Good boy. Okay. Drop. Good boy. But that's it. It's the end of my hunt. I appreciate you watching. See you next time.